Welcome. In front of me is a Lenovo IdeaTab Pro, and today I will show you how you can record screen on this tablet. So to get started, you want to swipe down from the top of your screen, which will bring down the toggles. And here you'll find a screen recording toggle, which looks like this just circle. You can extend it and it will also show you the name. And you can click on it. it gives you these, this pop-up right here, which will not be visible in the recording. And now we have the option for settings, uh, record and close. So I'm gonna utilize the record. Anyway, once you click on the button right there, it will save your screen recording to uh, your gallery or photos. Now on this device, I don't know if it's just the way it's set up right now because people, are, a lot of people use this device uh, at work here. Uh, it is a little bit messed up in the photos as it's not even showing what I just captured anywhere here as it normally should. So if for you, it's the same way for some reason, which I don't really think it should be like that. Uh, there's two ways of finding the screen recording. Number one would be to go to collections and you would have a screenshot, screen uh, recordings or videos album in which you will find it. Now in videos I can't see it, even though it has every vi screen recording that I can see here from different phones that are on the same account, but not this. Uh, so that's not how it's supposed to be. I do want to point that out. On the screenshots, is, uh, there's also nothing here, as you can see. So that leaves only last option, which is on device. And I can see it right here, screen recorder. And this is the recording. Now, there's actually a reason why I opened up Netflix is because that's what you will end up having uh, when you try to record applications uh, that just decide to completely uh, ignore that this is your device and completely ignore the terms and conditions that you did not agree to. Uh, so they use basically some kind of DRM protection which completely ignores the fact that you're not even logged in and ignores the fact that this is your device and just blocks your screen recorder from being able to record. Now, this is a normal thing that you'll encounter with some applications, just not all. Uh, the one that I always pick, it's Netflix, just because it comes pre-installed on your device without even you needing to do anything. So as an app that comes installed and does whatever you it wants on your device, you just kind of consider this to be a massive L and I will crap on this every time I can. Um, other applications like, for instance, bank apps will also use this feature, but at that point it is more designed for privacy and security of the user rather than corporate ass like it is for Netflix. So uh, in any case, if you found this video helpful, uh, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.